Hey guys, welcome back. So in this video, gonna be something completely different than what I usually do. So for me, um, I've had a little bit of a problem lately with um, kind of like losing hair. I've noticed it since I was about, I don't know, probably about maybe 16, 17. It was probably my later years in high school when I started noticing I was starting to lose a little bit of hair. Uh, I'd be like studying and then, you know, kind of like messing with my hair or whatnot, and then all of a sudden, like, I'd look down at my paper and be like five, six um, little strands of hair, like in my book or something like that, and I'm like, oh god, what's going on here? So, um, hair thinning and the receding hairline does kind of like, uh, does kind of happen in my family a little bit. My father has a little bit of it, um, and I was like, you know, kind of screwed already. What's going to happen? So, I switched to a couple things. Uh, I tried uh, Rogaine. Uh, that was okay, but I noticed it's, it's like it's good when you use it, but then as soon as you stop or you change it up a little bit and you kind of use less, it just goes right back to the way it was. So I stopped that and I'm like, oh, I'm not going to continue that. So, but I did try something. I did try Biotin, um, kind of like a supplement. So I did uh, buy that from Walmart, got the little, um, little tablet forms of it, and it's a 10,000 uh, micrograms. And you know, I've been taking them and I've just kind of like been toying with that a little bit here and there. I've taken like, you know, one pill, maybe two, three, just to see if it does anything. But the only thing I've noticed is that it doesn't actually reduce the amount of hair loss. It actually just makes my hair grow faster. So I was like, well, this is great, but I don't want to be growing hair that's not there. So I was like, well, good, but not good. Um, it's good for skin and nails. So, you know, my nails have been a little healthier, um, a little... They grow much faster, and my skin seems to be a little healthier too, a little clearer, a little um, like more resilient to things, and so that's kind of a good thing. So, but I'll definitely do a review on that later. But what I really want to show you is this new product I got. Um, they sell it on Amazon, but I also found it on eBay. It was only like ten dollars. So, right here, it's the Biotin shampoo. So, you know, I heard that you know it's like okay, you take Biotin for supplements, it's not going to do much for my hair. Well, this is supposed to remove any kind of like excess hormones, anything like that. I think it's like BHT, something like that, in the scalp, so that basically I won't get any um, progression of hair loss and I won't get any receding. So one major thing that I've noticed is like with my hair is that, I don't know if you can see here, and yeah, don't, just uh, don't look at the acne. <laughs> um, yeah, and I'm like 23, I'm like still suffering, that's great. Um, but anyway, so if you can see here, you see like long hair, but then you see like these little strands. That's one major um, kind of like, that's one big sign of like, your hair is thinning, it's falling out, it's getting to the point where I'm gonna be receding. So with, especially with my father, um, it goes like right here and on the sides and he's kind of like left here. So, and it's happening all through this area here. But I've noticed it's also been thinning inside the scalp too. It, it's, it feels thinner, it doesn't feel as healthy as it should. So um, I definitely wanted to try this out. I saw that there was another product, uh, it was the same company, the Biotin Shampoo, um, but it's a, it's a red bottle and it's supposed to be stronger. So I might try that, I don't know. It's So the company is known as Honeydew. I don't know if you can see that, it's right there. Don't know, just didn't want to touch my camera because then I was going to be shaking. Sorry. Anyways, so the shampoo, I thought it was a 16 ounce, but I got an 8 ounce, um, which is okay. I don't mind. Give it a little try. So here's the actual bottle itself. So it wants you to go ahead and rinse your hair and a uh, quarter sized amount in the palm of your hand and go ahead and kind of like massage it into the scalp. Uh, it seems to be okay. I've, I've Oh, DHT, DHT buildup, excuse me. No, I think I said BHT, DHT was close. So this can be used for men and women. That's a good thing. So men and women, you have any kind of hair loss, this is a, should be a good product. That's why I'm doing a review on it. So I'm gonna be doing a time progression to see if it even works. So we got all kinds of things in it. Of course, we want biotin. We got coconut oil, stuff like that that you can lava tree oil, argan oil, jojoba oil, it's really cool. So. Definitely gonna give it a try. Um, if not, if it doesn't seem to be doing that well, I might just do other things. So one thing is like, if you don't feel like doing this kind of stuff, you don't feel like giving it a try. See, my hair loss isn't as severe right now, but if you are starting to get like a big 
uh, progression of this uh, like massive hair loss and big receding, it's best to go talk to your dermatologist. Um, they can help you out, they can find out exactly what's wrong with you. So if this doesn't work, that's where I'm going. Um, I don't think I'm gonna try anything else. I'm just gonna go straight to the dermatologist. Um, but uh, as far as that goes, um, if you go and make an appointment, they can tell you, okay, it's uh, you know excess uh, excess amount of hormones. It's uh, your bad diet. Something's wrong with you. Your and even something's just changing your your diet can even help you with hair loss. So which is very good. That's why it's always good to consult with your um, your dermatologist first. But as for me, I'm stubborn and I wanted to do this for you guys. So. I'm gonna be doing the progression of this Biotin shampoo. Might change it up and do the red one since it's more intense, but let's go ahead and give it a shot. So why not? Hell with it. All right, so I'm back. So my hair is pretty, pretty well rinsed. It's very wet still, it's kind of damp, um, but I just wanted to show you guys what to do. So instead of going in the shower for you guys, I wanted to go ahead and do it this way just to show you exactly what the process is going to be like. I wanted to, Kind of give you a demonstration out here because I'm going to be doing this every time I rinse my hair and you know wash myself because I'm only going to be using this. I'm not going to be using any other um, any other shampoo because I've noticed like even if I wash my hair with like the best stuff, uh, anything um, you know, I think I had like L'Oreal or whatever had some kind of Tresemme stuff like that. I'm like you know it, it it's good, but uh, I still would get a ton of hair loss so. I'm like, I'm just gonna give this a go. I'm gonna see what exactly this is about. Hopefully it'll do something for me. Uh, let me make sure. Okay, there's a protective seal, so at least I don't look like an idiot and trying to pour it out onto my hand, nothing's coming out. All right, so let's see here, inside. Okay, that's an interesting smell. It smells almost like a, I'm definitely getting like a tree smell. Almost like, oh, it's like a peppery tree smell. So I definitely sense a bunch of interesting stuff in there. <laughs> hopefully this works. <laughs> and hopefully it doesn't make my hair smell really bad either. Um, so here we go. Okay, real quick. You see that I'm already like hair there, hair there. Yeah, so it's obviously it's coming out a lot. So let's go ahead and give this a go. I'm just gonna shake it a little bit. Don't know if that does anything, but Anyways, so here we go. Okay, that looks about good to me. So it says about a quarter sized, so looks about right. Just going to take it in both my hands here. And I'm gonna massage it through my hair, just like that. So, already very strange, it's kinda, it feels good. It's really soft. Huh, okay. Smells good too. It's not too bad as I thought it was. It was a little pungent at first. Okay. And then just kind of massage it into the scalp. That's the main point. Massage it in, massage it in. And even do the back of the head too. Massage that into the back. I don't know if you can see. Massaging it in. Probably not. It was probably bad. I think I'm doing good. Okay. I think that's about right, get it onto the sides. Okay, so that looks good there. So I'm gonna leave it like that. Now, it says to leave it in for about two or three minutes. Um, I'm gonna leave mine for about maybe four or five, depending, and I'm just gonna go ahead and wash it out. So uh, that way I can try to maximize the full effect. I can take out all those bad oils. And another reason why I don't wanna use regular shampoos anymore is because they can contain carcinogens and sometimes uh, interact with your body in weird ways and cause your hair to fall out even faster. So you gotta watch out with the kind of shampoos you use. Um, I think I used to use like VO5 or whatever it was. Um, it's cheap, cheap brand, of course. You know, I mean, living on a college salary, it's like, yeah, it's like, hey, why not? It's cheap, gonna use it, you know, does its job. And it wasn't so bad then, but it seems like my hair loss has kind of increased. So I'm trying this out. If it gets any worse, dermatologist I go. So anyways, I am going to let this sit and then wash it out and we'll see if we see any difference. Okay, so it's been about four minutes um, and it's like weird, it's like the hair kind of feels like it's not soap, it's like oil, very strange. 
it's hard for me to describe it. It's like this, it's got this like glossy kind of feel to it. It feels good. Um, but I heard the shampoo is supposed to like help make your hair feel thicker and fuller and healthier. So, and it's supposed to reduce the amount of hair loss. So we'll see. Um, but now I'm going to go ahead and rinse it out and we'll see how it feels afterwards. I went ahead and rinsed my hair off and it feels like I just got done with shampooing and conditioning my hair. It feels nice. It doesn't feel like that uh, nasty, oily, greasy feel like I thought it was gonna, like I was gonna be left with, but it actually feels soft. Not too bad. Of course, I'm not gonna see any real results today, so I'll probably make another video in like a week to see what actually happens. Um, but so far, so good. I mean, it, it's drying pretty well, so I just rinsed it out and it feels okay so far, so. Okay, I guess we're gonna see how this works. <laughs> so, hopefully it'll be good, um, but I will make another update in a week to let you guys know what's going on. I will also be taking the biotin uh, supplements as well, so then that way it's kind of internal and external. That way um, we'll maximize uh, the results here and hopefully we'll get some good, uh, uh, some good outcomes because uh, it's a little depressing losing your hair. Um, it's a little unfortunate, but uh, you know, most people go through it in, in some point in their life and I knew it was going to hit me around my 20s, so we'll see. We'll see exactly what happens, but uh, I probably need a, actually like another haircut here soon, to be honest, with these supplements, uh, which is a good thing, but don't want to keep cutting my hair off and <laughs> be left with nothing. So anyways, guys, thank you so much again for watching. I hope you guys will stick, you know, stick to this and stay tuned with me through my journey and hopefully this will work. If not, uh, off to the dermatologist I go. But as for now, thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a great day and stay tuned for other videos. All right, bye guys, have a good one.